In this video, we will learn that how we can test the row level security in the cloud. So in the last video, you have seen that we have uh, implemented the row level security in the Power BI desktop. And uh, we have uh, created uh, two roles. As you can see here, we have created one role for the marketing and the other role for the senior management. The senior management can only see the UK and the United States data and the people with marketing role can see the data beside UK and United States. So now we need to deploy this report. So click publish, save, and uh, we need to choose our destination that is my workspace, select. So the report is now published to the Power BI Cloud. So let's open it, click here. And uh, we have to choose our login. So here you can see, we have all the data, United States, United Kingdom, and all the other countries. And now we need to assign the users to the role that we have created. For that, we need to create first users, right? So let me show you how to create users in the Power BI. So here you can see the app launcher. You need to click here and uh, go to the admin. In the free version of Power BI Cloud, we can't create the users. So that's why you have to purchase either you can use the trial version, right? So if you click here, users, active users. So here you can see I have created these users, right? And if you want to create uh, multiple users, you have to click add users. And uh, you need to provide all the credentials. And in this way, you can create the users. Okay, so we don't need to create any user because I have created enough user for the demonstration. So we need to cancel it. And uh, let's again click here app launcher and click to the Power BI. So here you can see if you click my workspace and uh, here you can see we have a different uh, report and uh, data sets. So here you can see we have uh, the report name is practice and the data, data set name is also practice. If I click uh, report, so here you can see, I can see all the countries, right? And uh, again, click with my workspace. So to assign users to the roles, we need to go to the data set and you need to click here and then security. So as you can see, we have two roles that we had created, marketing and senior management. And for the marketing, we need to add one role, for example, um, asset at learndust.com, add, save. And then in the senior management, we have to add Tahir at uh, learndux.com. So that's all. So if I click here to the report like this and uh, copy this link and go to another browser, paste, and here we have to choose the account like uh, us at that learned us dot com. this email address is assigned to the marketing role sign in so as you can see now we are able to see the data that belong to the marketing like germany canada australia and uh, france right so let's try to close it so let's try for the senior management role And here you can see, we are only able to see a United States and United Kingdom. So in this video, we have learned that how to test row level security in the Power BI Cloud. So if you like this video, please subscribe our channel. And if you have any question, please write in the comment section. Thank you.